Nowadays, more and more people are opting for a child-free lifestyle and it's becoming a pretty big trend. But why is that? Why are people choosing not to have kids? Hi, I'm Neither Shkor. I'm a relationship and a dating coach and a TEDx speaker. And today I'll be talking about the child-free debate. First up, let's talk about money. Kids are expensive. There's no denying it. Between diapers, formula, clothes, food, and all the other things they need, having a baby can set you back tens of thousands of dollars. And that's just in the first year. As they grow up, the expenses just keep adding up. With school fees, extracurricular activities, and the never ending stream of I want that come with being a kid. For a lot of people, the financial burden of having children is simply too much. They'd rather live a more comfortable life and be able to travel, save up for retirement, or just enjoy their hard-earned money without feeling guilty about spending it on themselves. Another big reason that people are going child-free is because of their careers. Now these days, a lot of people are putting their careers first and that can be pretty hard to when you have kids. Between the time and energy it takes to take care of them and the need to be there for school events and doctor's appointments, it can be a real struggle to balance a career and parenthood. Now for many people, having a child just isn't compatible with their career goals. They want to be able to focus on their job travel for work and put in long hours if that's what it takes to get ahead. And while some parents are able to make it work, others just can't. It's a choice that they have to make and often child-free living wins out. Also, let us not forget about the environmental impact of having children. They may feel that the world is already overpopulated and that reducing the number of new humans born is an ethical choice that can help alleviate pressure on the environment. Having a child is a big decision and for some, the thought of bringing another person into the world when it's already facing so many problems is just too much to bear. Childhood trauma. Childhood trauma can also play a role in someone's decision to live child-free. For some individuals, the experiences they went through as children can make them hesitant to bring children of their own this could be due to physical, emotional or sexual abuse or exposure to substance abuse, domestic violence or other traumatic events. The fear of passing down these traumas or being unable to protect their own children from similar experiences can be overwhelming, leading them to choose a child-free lifestyle. Trauma can affect one's ability to trust and form healthy relationships and can cause feelings of anxiety, fear and helplessness. For some, the thought of taking on the responsibility of caring for a child may feel overwhelming or even triggering, bringing up painful memories and emotions. Of course, living a child-free life is not always because of career or financial reasons or childhood trauma. Some people just don't feel like they have the right temperament or personality to be a parent. Taking care of a child is a big, big responsibility and it's not something that everyone is cut out for. Some people value their independence and freedom too much and they are worried that having a child will take that away. So, there you have it. Some of the big reasons why people are choosing to go child-free. But let's be real, it's not always an easy choice. Society puts a lot of pressure on people to have kids and child-free individuals often have to face a lot of judgment and criticism from others. But at the end of the day, it's their life and they get to make the choices that are right for them. Let me know what you think about going child-free in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe.